everybody and welcome to a very special edition of Today in Science. I am here in a scientist playground in warm and sunny Puerto Rico. While the rest of the world is sitting on the beach having a smoothie, these scientists are sitting in front of the world's largest radio and radar telescope, specifically Cornell scientists with a very lovely grant to study our planet, the solar system, the galaxy, the stratosphere, and all of the elements that make up our universe. One of the things they are studying are radio waves. We can't see radio waves, but we can study them. And upstairs in this very place, there are 30 scientists working away on their hypothesis hoping to prove of their doctoral dissertation that aliens do exist. Have you ever wondered about our universe? Have you wondered where we came from? I have. And I hope these scientists are going to help us figure out the answers to these big questions. This telescope was the first to detect water on Mercury in 1991. And in 2011, NASA spacecraft Mariner confirmed there is ice on Mercury. Other exciting research coming from this National Science Foundation telescope involves mapping the Milky Way. This study gives hints about the history of the Milky Way, our galaxy, and its elements. Scientists found new massive star formations including the farthest objects in our galaxy. Gotta love the National Science Foundation. I hope you've enjoyed this special field trip on This Week in Science. See you next week!